Thank you to the Broadway League and to the American Theatre Wing and to the people on the committee who grant the Tony Honors for Excellence in Theatre. And thank you especially to my musical colleagues led by Michael Starobin who signed a letter supporting me for this honor. It is so precious to me because it's a personal acknowledgement of my achievement from giants in my field. Um, friends who know me know that um, I could, I've been given 90 seconds and I, friends know me, I can talk for 90 minutes. So I'm gonna start reading so I can stay on track. But more than that, it's a recognition of a kind of stealth work that's done by so many other artists and colleagues who don't often get into the spotlight. And so I'm happy to represent them. It celebrates the music copying profession as a whole and people who did this long before me and taught me everything, and the people who continue to do this work who I hope have learned from me as well. Music copying is a field that more than many others has historically allowed women to succeed. So I have to mention the pioneer copyist and special Tony winner, Matilda Pincus, Judy Herring of Associated Music, who gave me a work home so many decades ago, and Tina Hoffmeister, a gifted calligrapher and copyist and beloved Local 802 administrator. We need more strong professional women like this in the field, and so my work on the board of Maestra aims to ensure that women and non-binary people in musical theater have equal access to the many types of jobs in this field. And thank you to my business, Emily Grishman Music Preparation, which would not exist without the co-supervision of Kathy Edmonds and now Adriana Grace and Alden Terry, along with the hard work of Ed Gregg and David Horn. Each of these friends has worked with me for more than 20 years. And saving the best for last, thanks to my wife, Susan Samfliner. She's always shared her deep understanding from a management perspective of how an entire show is put together, apart from just the music. And I know that I'm better and better at my job as a result of learning from her. Thanks for an amazing 30 years, Suze. It's no news that the pandemic shutdown was a watershed for our industry, but it allowed so many of us to come together to build a better and more welcoming community. I know that it was for me an opportunity to connect with colleagues and friends like never before. And that is the most meaningful part of these Tony celebrations as well. Thanks again for this honor.